Okay. So minus 150. Shadows off. Core. The run. No. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 15 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Also no. high rose fire. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer... How many times do I have to hop over the bed before I get a good run? When will I be able to just not fucking hop over the bed? If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Now, please return to your bed. Good morning. You have been in suspension for... I'm gonna go ahead and, uh... Take this shit out of the door. Okay. Oh, oh, you look... Good. Good, actually. Are you okay? Are, are you... No, answer that. I'm actually sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take this. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm, stay, stay calm, prepare. You know what I'm saying? Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. <laughs> some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just, you just jump. But never mind, say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what, that's close enough. Just hold tight. Oh, God. That's pretty great that six minutes, like, just gets wasted. Just because of one fucking thing. Hey, look, I was gonna mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How you doing down there? You still holding on? That loses 15 seconds. So of course the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, one should tell me anything. Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. Why? Close. Can you see? So I'm gonna make it through, but out of space. Uh, just, just gotta get through here. Right, I just gotta concentrate. And whose fault do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, so now I hear that one. I hear that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, Tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Alright? Not dead. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall okay. is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're gonna need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Good news, that is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Almost there. Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. 
seriously do hold on this time. Fuck. Too early. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical Bullshit. difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The portal will open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. You have just passed through an Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grid, which vaporizes most Aperture Science equipment that touches it. I'm going to say... probably 535. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Oh, God. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Still might be ahead. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Let's hope. Let's hope I can actually do this. Or do something, I don't know. Just... Mm -hmm. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is in case... Hey! You made it! Oh! Nice. Whatever. Still better than missing it. Some <sighs> every time that lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics. Please note it on your self reporting form. A future aperture science entitlement associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Not even red, though. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed in three, two, one. Dude, get the fuck in there. Give me that portal. Get the fuck in there, dude. Track yourself. Congratulations. The exit door is now open. I'm screwed. Stupid place to lose time. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments. Could have been a lot better. <laughs> but whatever, it was fine. <clears throat> I'll save some time. Definitely. Yeah, a little bit. Could still be green after this. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future, and the future starts with you. I feel like when I get the record, I would have been doing it for so long that this just becomes a meme. Good work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe Too early. and send back someone better qualified for testing. Nope. Best fade ever.
plus two. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The enrichment center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this. Dude, concept. give me something. Oh my god. That's bullshit. Oh, fuck. I'm so fast. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're if I here, so get ready to catch am me. read I'm out of chapter one, not dead, the I don't know. I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? One. Two. Three. That's high. It's, it's too high, isn't it, really, that? All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me! Ow! I am not dead! I'm not dead! <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. Oh, no. Oh, my yes. God. Hello, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. Slow. I'm going to lose time here. I never lose time here. Except for just now. Oh, yeah. I fucking fell through the thing. So, yeah. Fuck. <laughs> I'm to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go Fucking damn it. Chamber, and she will nice. If, if she's um, awake. Mm. Okay, I'm going to leave my card on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't, don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over it. She's off. All fine. Let me go. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up uh, you know, taking her down here? You're not going to believe ah! Still held, still being held. You think that's a great job. You've applied the great work. Ah, I just sorry, I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah, I just done it again. This is the main breaker room. Look for a switch that says escape pod. Alright, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't even don't even look at anything else. Just well obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something and it doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing, alright? But don't touch anything else or look at well look at other things, but don't you understand. Can you see it anywhere? That made me pissed. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. Let there be light. That's, uh, God. He's quoting God. Oh, look at that. <sighs> totally. Fuck. Ominous. Too late the to be doing this. Long as it start, you know, moving up. No. Escape pod, escape pod. It's, it's moving up. Okay. Okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Why do I have to be pissed off right now? I don't even know. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. I can, I can still stop this. Son of a bitch. Oh, there's a, there's a password. I think it's just way too fucking hot in here, and I can't do anything about it because my computer is just emitting heat like it's, it's job, which I guess it is. I need power thing. Did I do big with the job head? Start writing these power up complete. I don't okay, 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 listen. Alright, new uh why does it have to be so hot in no. here? Oh, it's I mean if I had an AC then no things would be different, but mm. I do not. I've been really busy again. After you murdered me. You did what? Uh. Oh no! No 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 no! <sighs> oh, no, no, no Damn. No, no, no. Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it, too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of. Oh, cool, I got to 800 followers, I mean... Thank you guys. Man. I would, but everyone's, not everyone, just the person who's next to me is fucking sleeping. And a little bit of light, that's too much. Even though it's the weekend. I don't really want to get into this stuff. It's just, uh... Here we are. The incinerator room. 
Be careful not to trip over any parts of them. They didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. Thought I saw that right, plus Even twelve. The portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Good. You have the dual portal to player. Fuck. I'll just move that out of the way for you. This place really is a wreck. But the important thing is you're back with me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After well, I'm definitely that, not going to be ahead. I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. <sighs> Oh wow, what a time save. Sorry about the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, y'all fan. I forgot how good you are at this. I'm bored out of my mind, so I'm just gonna do another reportal and laser overgo. See if it works or not. This next test involves discouragement redirection cues. I just finished building them before you had your well. Episode. Where'd it go? So uh, now well done. Here come the test results. Well, that's gonna lose time. You are a, a little bit, person. not much. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. It's actually fine now. I mean, the temperature, I don't know. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth month. Congratulations. Get in Not there. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. One moment. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. <sighs> Why? I always feel like I'm just gonna make it. I never do. Do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Dumb. Lost three seconds. Great. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate. Here's an interesting fact. You're not Whatever. even real. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. Hmm. Barely lost Let's any time. See what the next test is. Oh, advanced air in your face place. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. No! Oh my god, dude. Oops, I had a little bit of speed coming out of that. The test chambers. So Almost died. Still trash in them, standing around, smelling and being useless. Nice Talk buffer. Avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. 
which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Uh. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Son of a bitch. Give me that shot. <laughs> Fuck. This is gonna happen again. I'm so pissed off, it's unbelievable. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that yeah, test subjects I am. cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This and now they're gonna be bad. Don't take anything with you. I guess 15 seconds? Because why the fuck not? <laughs> God, this entire time, I haven't seen how long I've been streaming. Almost five hours. Great. This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Cannot get a good chapter too. I can't get any good chapters. The only good chapter I got was that time that I saved like 13 seconds in chapter 5. Defeated its load bearing capacity. Too little, too late. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. Cool. Shit. I'll save time here, but it's not enough. It won't be enough, as always. Yeah, five seconds. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the circus. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. Well, you passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. Well, like, it's still world record if that's what you're asking. I don't know. It's probably not what you're asking at all. Like, I'm dumb. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. Excellent. Hmm, almost died. Not really. Tests are your prey. But, Speaking yeah. of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess sharks? Because that's wrong. The correct answer is no. I have to pee now. Nobody Great. Nobody knew is that pointlessly cruel. At least I'm not bleeding time. I figured out what to do with all the money I saved recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future Good. generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone struck. Well done. In fact, you did so well. That's I'm good. Going to note this on your file in the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. Perfect. Perfect. Indeed. Mm -hmm. 
same fucking split. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh wait, that's you in five seconds. Good luck. Oh god. Should be fine. Just try not to fuck it up. Oh. To maintain a constant testing cycle, I simulate daylight at all. Didn't get a boost. That's fine. Supply. So you may be confused about the passage of time. At least I have a shot right now. Yesterday was your birthday. I thought you'd want to know. Even if it's probably gonna get screwed up really easily. You know how I'm going that to was stupid. Forever. You're going to be dead in 60 years. Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. Okay. Let's do this shit. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your phone. On other people it looks fine. But right here a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. Well, what does a neck bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably Oh, wait. It's a she. I'm going I'm gonna to lose a little time there, but whatever. In cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. A man and a woman. So that's interesting. It's a small world. I'm not gonna risk anything here. I got five, four seconds to save, so I'll just save three. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you that spoiled the surprise, so I'll just give you a hint. It involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. Okay, chapter three for how bad chapter two was. Thanks, Pitflings. It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. Well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. I bet you think I forgot about your surprise. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. Now for the chamber that always kills runs, yay. Let's hope that it goes kind of better than it's been going. Maybe actually give me both cubes. Initiating surprise in three, two, one. I made it all up. Surprise. Oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Shit. Fuck. I had to shoot that portal. That goddamn portal. Okay, whatever. Give me a shot, dude. Stop being a dick. Please. Oh, I almost missed that shot. I'm gonna lose time here for sure. As always, I always lose time there. Gotta save it in trip or laser chaining. Those roller coaster splits again. I'm on a break, mate. On a break. Ow! Just hang in there for five more. Whoa, Jerry, you can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced work site should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jerry. 
See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there. Let's see what the damage is. Probably lost like seven seconds. Eight. Good. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And oh my god. Sleep for a while. So I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. No, fucker. My god. I thought about our dilemma, and I came up with a solution that I honestly think works out best for one of both. I'm gonna lose time here, which is stupid. Well, maybe not, I don't know. I caught it pretty early on. That stupid ass cube. <laughs> Barely lost time. Federal regulations require me to warn you that this next test chamber is looking pretty good. That's right. I think these test chambers look even better than they did before. That's gonna lose me some time too. You just have to look at things objectively. See what you don't need. More than point two. And trim out because this was really good. Hmm. Mm. Oh wow. I've Only two seconds. For you after this next test. Not a fake and tragic surprise like last time. A real surprise with tragic consequences. No, I strafed. I'm an idiot. Fuck. Hey, buddy, I'm speaking in an accent Bleh. that is beyond her range of hearing. Look, metal ball, I can. Run, 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 come on, let's run. Oh my god. <laughs> Shit. Run, for goodness sake. The irony is you are almost at the last test. Good enough. I'm gonna lose time, but it's because I didn't get the good route. Don't kill me, please. Fine, whatever. No good route. Oh, fuck. I still have 300 speed. <sighs> More time loss. I'm now officially bleeding time. It's great. Yeah. So if I played perfectly, I could save 15 seconds in this chapter. Not this chapter, but this chapter. Stuff that I'm gonna lose a hop and then I'm probably gonna miss the cycle. Whatever, that's like nothing. They say that the old caretaker of this place absolutely crazy. Chopped up his entire staff. Robots. Robots. They say at night you can still hear the screams of their weapons. All of them functionally indistinguishable. No memory of the internet. Nobody knows what they're screaming. Damn. Ooh, almost died there. <sighs> Shit. What a dumb time loss. That was an okay turret factory, and I lost time. Damn. 
redemption Fuck. lines are not rides. Here it goes. The redemption line. Bad cycle, right? Right. That isn't good. Oh, it's fine. That's like the quickest. Jesus. To bring your daughter to work day. That did not end well. And 40 potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realize they're children, but still, no hanging fruit. Nice. On the railing. Now I can't get past Weekly. Sure right That's fine. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing you 100% this way. Okay, let's try this one. All right, then. She can't use her turrets, so let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. I gotta pee after this. <laughs> God damn. What is that? Is that time safe? Oh, fuck off. Ha, I knew we were going the right way. This is the neurotoxin generator. A bit bigger than I expected. I'm not going to be able to just, you know, push it over. have to apply some cleverness. There's some sort of control room up at the top. So... Okay, good. Good news. I can use this equipment. You smell neurotoxin. Hold up. The neurotoxin levels are going down. So whatever you're doing... Hmm. Almost missed that shot. Yes. Hold on. Warning. Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. Here back. This should take us right to her. I can't believe I'm finally doing this. Woo! <laughs> I knew this would be fun. They told me it wasn't fun at all. Well, they said it's not fun at all. And I, I, I believed them. I thought I was a fool to myself. Oh, I'm, I'm, lo I'm loving this. Why am I time? This place is huge, and we're only seeing the top layer. It goes down for miles. All sealed off years ago, of course. We should be getting close. Oh, I can't wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turret. She'll never know what hit her. <laughs> hold on, hold on, because I, I, I might not have thought this next part. Ah! Well, uh, I, I'm, I'm going the wrong way. Get to her. I'll find you. It's not looking very hopeful, but it kind of is. I don't know. I mean, I'm supposed to save time in chapter five. Oh God. See, the problem is, I honestly, truly didn't think you'd fall for that. I think that was an amazing you chapter three, much more and I didn't really for when you expect that. This easy one. If I'd known you let yourself get captured this easily, I would have just dangled a turkey leg on a rope from the ceiling. I mean, it had to be. Well, whatever. Nice I want to get a banana. <laughs> so, I hope you brought something stronger than a portal gun this time. Otherwise, I'm afraid you're about to become the immediate past president of the Being Alive Club. Uh huh. Seriously, though. Goodbye. <laughs> Big chance. This is trouble. <laughs> ah, not again. Here comes the lady. Ah, oh, this ain't. Oh, you were busy 
back there. Well, I suppose we could just sit in this room and glare at each other until somebody drops dead. But I have a better idea. It's your old friend, Deadly Neurotoxin. If I were you, I'd take a deep breath. So, we have no more bananas, so I just decided to get a jet wash. That's funny. I don't got a jet wash. In fact, I feel pretty good. Alternate core detected. Oh, that's me they're talking mm. about. To initiate a core transfer, deposit substitute core in receptacle. Port. Substitute core accepted. Substitute core. Are you ready to start the procedure? Yes. <laughs> Corrupted core. Are you ready to start the procedure? All right. No. Oh, yes, she is. No, 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 no. Stalemate detected. Transfer procedure cannot continue. Yes. Unless a stalemate associate is present to press the stalemate resolution button. Oh man. Get. Stalemate resolved. Jesus Christ. That was bad. Oh, it will. Believe me, it will. Are you are you just saying that, or is it really gonna hurt? You're just saying that, aren't you? You're just no, you're not. You are. It is gonna hurt you. Exactly. How painful are we talking? Ah! Oh, no. No. I don't even know what I just said, but I can find out. Oh, sorry, no, the lift. Yes, sorry, keep forgetting. This body is amazing, seriously. I can't get over how small you are, but I'm huge. <laughs> Got it. I needed that. Still lost time, though. Damn. Awesome. Pretty damn good.
Mm. Grounded from Twitch. Hi, Theodrian. And yeah, hi, Yingler. Sure. <clears throat> Go. Sucks. Hmm. All right, let's get started. This first test involves something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. The last poor son of a gun got blue. Damn. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Fuck. He broke every bone in his legs. <laughs> Fuck me. What am I doing? The lab boys just informed me that I should not have mentioned the control group. They're telling me I ought to stop making these pre recorded messages. That gave me well, a this next test. More pre recorded particles in the jail. I pay the bills here. I can talk about the control group all day and day. Gizmos that are going to travel in your bloodstream and pump experimental genes and RNA molecules. What? Fucking give me this shit. That's annoying as shit. I'm gonna lose a lot of time here. Oh, in case you get covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered. Don't be too early. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this: it's a lively one, and it does not like the human skeleton. Good. Still losing a lot of time. All these science fears are made of asbestos, by the way. Keeps out the rats. Let us know if you feel a shortness of breath, a persistent dry cough, or your heart stopping. Because that's not part of the test. I like your style. You make up your own rules, just like me. Beam counter said I couldn't fire a man just for being in a wheelchair. Did it anyway. Ramps are expensive. Just a heads up, that coffee we gave you earlier had fluorescent calcium in it so we can track the neuronal activity in your brain. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Hmm. I'm done with that. Control group Kepler 7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping, if you're hearing this, it means you're taking a long time on the catwalks between tests. The lab boys say that might be a fear reaction. I'm no psychiatrist, but coming from a bunch of eggheads who wouldn't oh my god, no. Great. Fuck off! Fucking scroll wheel, dude. My mouse is like... God damn it. Oh, I call him. Colon. This game is raping me, my friend. Now it's just another shitty run before chapter seven has to be beautiful. Congratulations. The simple fact 
you're standing here listening to me means you've made a glorious fuck god damn it this run is like over now uh, way to lose a second over that I'm an idiot. I don't know. I wasn't talking about Nirvana. The testing area is just up ahead. The quicker you get through, the quicker you'll get your sixty bucks. Shit. Motherfucker, I'm losing another eight seconds. Because I can't re portal. Good job, astronaut, war hero, and or Olympian. With your help, we're gonna take the world. This on? Hey, listen up down there. That thing's called an elevator, not a bathroom. I swear I know him. I like being bound to lose time. Makes things really nice. Fuck it, just PB. I don't even care anymore. If you're interested in an additional sixty dollars, flag down a test associate and let them know. You can walk the fork. In case you're interested, there's still some positions available for that bonus opportunity I mentioned earlier. Again, all you gotta do is let us disassemble you. We're not banging rocks together here. We know how to put a man back together. So, that's a complete reassembly. New vitals, spit shine on the old ones, plus we're scooping out tumors. Frankly, you ought to be paying us. Oh, uh, yeah. Let's do it. Portal falling on. Thank you. I can't believe I'm thanking you. For staggering your way through Aperture Science's propulsion gel testing, you've made some real contributions to society for a change, and for that, humanity is grateful. If you had any belongings, Fuck, that's too. Uh, I don't know what to do about that. For many of you, I before it turns into a thousand seconds of time loss, just correct that shit. Mandatory for all employees, the quality of our test subjects has risen dramatically. Employee retention, however, has not. <coughs> As a result, you may have heard we're going to phase out human testing. I'm going to lose time, though. Things left to wrap up, though. The bean counters told me I don't lose too much. Afford to buy seven dollars worth of moon rocks, much less seventy million. Bought them anyway. Ground them up, mixed them into a gel. And guess what? Ground up moon rocks are pure poison. I am deathly ill. Still, it turns out they're a great portal conductor. So now, we're gonna see if jumping in and out of these new portals can somehow leave. Fucking goddamn it! I did it again! Yay! Fuck. Hard. Fuck Snurn setup. His backup, I mean. Fuck, get off of there. Shit. Well, it's a lot of people's favorite quote. I'm gonna lose like 15 seconds. Yeah, 18. Give me a fucking break.
I know who you are. Okay, good. Now I have a shot. Just a shot. Because I kind of fucked up some, uh... I don't know. Did I even save time? Wow, I did save time. Fuck. time here. Here's an idea. Since making tests just a little bit though. Why don't you just keep solving this test? Same one. And I can just like, watch you solve it. Yeah, that and nothing. Alright, can't blame me for trying. Okay, new tests. New tests. Gotta be some tests around here somewhere. Might even save time. Uh, I don't know if I save time. I should know how to do this now. Like without dying. Good start. Get the fuck down, you idiot. 
disappointing. Mm. That's not good. I'm gonna lose time there. Great. Alright, so that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently being civil isn't I know. If I'm such a moron, why can't you solve a simple test? the last one just now the hardest one. Oh, what, what was that there was nothing there was nothing what an unfortunate chapter six and seven I had Okay, well, hopefully that does something. Hopefully it's good. Nope, bad. Always. Oh, fuck, man. Have a brainwave. I'm gonna take you solving these and then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related note, I am gonna need you to solve these ten times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a wave which Fuck off. This one, all right? I don't want to spoil the ending. Mm. Could have saved five seconds. No, I will not. Good fate, at least. I'm still losing time because of that fucking circle jump. Dude. Was was self-destructing, already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor for all time's sake. Two, I have one or two more tremors in there just for fun. Morning. Core overheating. I let him keep his job. Oh my god. Fucking laser catapult, dude. Or laser platform. Alright, still nothing. Let's keep moving. Sorry about the lift, it's out of service because it melted. I'm gonna save time now. After you told me to turn that beam off, I thought I had lost it. Nah. Not saving any time there. Oh, I did find something though. Reminds me, I've got a big surprise for you two. Seriously, look forward to it. I guess I could have saved a second, but now 
I don't actually I might be able to still save time I'm not really sure maybe a little bit if it's a little more than a second I can save and it's not I lost time Give me a shot. Go fucking faster, please. You son of a bitch. I'm trying to fucking wall strafe here, not... Yeah. Well, I'd have to lose 30 seconds in order to uh, not PB. Which might be really easy, actually, which sucks. Still a bad run. Okay, that was dumb, but whatever. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm almost there. Ah. Don't mind me. Continue escaping. This might be too high. If it is, I'm gonna cry. safer than normal, as I always do in a PB type of pace. Shit PB, but still. I got a PB. Like, I can't just... I can't go this long and not PB. That's bullshit. Let's see... Something up. According to the control panel light up there, the 
Just give me a fucking PB. That's all I want. I'm already 20 seconds ahead. Don't, don't make this just be shitty. So sick of just having a shitty everything. Well, we should leave allegedly two minutes to figure out how to shut down whatever is starting all the fires. So anyway, that's the itinerary. Also, I took the liberty of watching the tapes of you killing her, and I'm not going to make the same mistakes. Four part plan is this. One, no portal surfaces. Two, start the neurotoxin immediately. Three, bomb-proof shields for me. Leading directly onto number four, bombs are throwing it. You know what? Please give me good RNG. I'm going to be so I'm gonna pissed. Get a chance and turn if it's the not. Neurotoxin. I'm joking, of course. Goodbye. Neurotoxin level at capacity in five minutes. Oh, ah, oh, oh, ah! Ha, that's sounded real. No, that was actually an impression of you. Actually, because you just fell into my trap, my brilliant trap. Just then, I wanted you. Ah! This might not be good. At 50%. Vent system compromised. Neurotoxin offline. Reactor explosion in four uh, minutes. What, what happened? Ah! Okay, great. Here comes another core. Quick, what's the situation? Oh. Warning. Core corruption at 75%. Reactor explosion timer destroyed. Reactor explosion uncertainty emergency preemption protocol initiated. This facility will self-destruct in two minutes. Enough! I told you not to put these cores on, but you don't listen, do you? Quiet. Ah! Fuck yeah. Warning. PB! At 100%. Core replacement required. Oh, I see. <laughs> Substitute core. Are you ready to start? Corrupted core. Are you ready to start? What do you think? Interpreting vague answer as yes. No, 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 no. Pick up on my sarcasm. Stalemate detected. Fire detected in the stalemate resolution. Bad areas. though. Extinguishing. That just cleans right off, does it? Well, that would have been good to know a little earlier. Stalemate resolution associate. Please motion button. Go press the button. Go press the button. Do not fly! Booby trap the stalemate button! Not sub 105, Are but... Still alive? Whatever, you I guess it's PV. You have got to be kidding me! Well, I'm still in control, and I have no idea how to fix this place. Oh! It's about a fifth, 105.10, maybe a little bit worse than that. Yeah. Guess it was a PB. Really good chapter 8. Really nice chapter 5, amazing chapter 3, everything else was kind of like, eh. Could have done a lot better in chapter 6. Chapter 7 was just, ugh, god, I don't want to think about it. Uh, um, I saved time over your uh, 3 gels, I didn't know how that happened, maybe like, because I got a, a lower stuff launch or something, but uh, what else? Hmm. I could use a better time, but oh, thank God. guess I'm happy that run got a PB. You know, being Carolyn taught me a valuable lesson. I thought you were my greatest enemy. Yay. You know, you were my best friend. Some. The surge of emotion that shot through me when I saved your life taught me an even more valuable lesson. Where Carolyn lives in my brain. Carolyn, delete. Goodbye. Carolyn. You know, deleting Carolyn just now taught me a valuable lesson. The best solution to a problem is usually the easiest one. And I'll be honest, killing you is hard. 
You know what my days used to be like? I just tested. Nobody murdered me, or put me in a potato, Ugh. or fed me to birds. Hey, it's better than the last I world record. A good life. And then you should you dangerous mute lunatic. No, I just gotta save a minute and however just much more time. Go. <laughs> it's been fun. Definitely have a minute to Don't save. Looks like I saved 15 seconds or so over um some of the splits. Nice. 